Welcome back to Spirit of a Handyman. Today I'm testing Flex Seal because I have this uh, little water table project here, but it won't hold water, will it? No, no. It's got a, uh, a leak. So a couple cracks yeah. that are kind of around the edges. And I'm hoping that this will cure it. So it's not a question of will it fill the cracks. It's a question of will it hold, um, like it needs to become a slightly structural. But on the video, the TV commercial, he rides in a screen boat of this. So surely it'll work, right? Let's find out. All in all, I was very impressed with the coverage that this spray can does. It applied very evenly. You just have to keep moving and make sure that it doesn't glob up in one spot. And I kind of wonder if I put it on a little too thick around the place that actually matters. So there was kind of a crack going around the edge. Test day. Time to see if our uh, flex seal is worth its money. So we had a couple spots right around here that were leaking. There was a spot over here that was leaking. Except that no, no. leaking. We sealed it on the, the bottom side down here and sealed it from the top side. So the big question is if the little hands start to push down, will if it will also be a strong enough um, adhesion oh. to like not just cover the crack but also like be a bonding agent to hold the, the two pieces together. That will be the ultimate test. I'm seeing. Yeah. I see dripping. All right. So here we are at the bottom, and it looks like some of this is squeezing on through. Um, I think I applied it a little too thick, so maybe a uh, two coats. Um, using one more can um, and use a couple more thin coats and maybe that'll do it. Let's try it. So one layer of Flex Seal was not enough to fully do the job. So I went ahead and got a white layer. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply this to the black and then I'll have two layers. I can kind of see what's going on. Hopefully this is enough to really seal the deal. And here's the coverage on the bottom side. Um, it is looking totally cured. So we're just gonna let it dry for 24, maybe 48 hours and then give it a go. All right, time to test and see if the second coat of Flex Seal has worked. But first, big wheel brake. Yeah! All right, so here we are, round two. Oh. Um, again, it's got a very repellent feel to it, at least initially, so the water's kind of beaten up. Um, I rigged the cork instead of using the kid's finger this time. Alright, so far so good. It's holding water. Let's go ahead and put a little pressure on the top. No! So it looks like two coats of Flex Seal allow 48 hours to dry and that has cured it. Flex Seal, you've done it again. Or at least this is the first time. So you've done it one time. I would love it if you would subscribe. Uh, that would just make me so energized to make more videos for you guys. I, I just love to uh, post these things to help empower and equip you guys. Hey, comment down below. What's the craziest thing you've used Flex Seal to seal? Has it worked for you? In the meantime, this is Spirit of a Handyman signing off. It's Flex Seal the works for me. Spirit of a handyman. A handyman.